Mitch, how frustrating has this injury layoff been for you? Yeah, it's uh, it's been really annoying to be honest. Uh, it's just every time I seem to get going, I'm picking up an injury. But it's rugby league, so yeah, that's that's part part and parcel of it. Particularly frustrating when you're watching the boys desperate to get out there and help them out. Yeah, it's it's disappointing. You know, obviously it's a team sport. And I'm, I'm all I'm mates of all of them, and it's just disappointing to not be out, out there and helping them at the minute. Is this the, the longest injury layoff you've had in your career so far? Yeah, in the in the in recent times, yeah, it's just. Um, it's just one of those things. It's it's just just really really been disappointing on a personal level, but you know it's, it is what it is. And how's how's progress going with it? Yeah, I'm there or thereabouts. I've probably got another two or three weeks, I think, where I've got to uh, get some running into my legs and do all the, tick all the boxes. But it's feeling reasonably well. Um, Ian Kirk's done a really good job with uh, with the programs that he's done for me. So hopefully, I come back in pretty good nick. How have you been out to keep your, your conditioning in, in? Obviously, you can't do much running. Yeah, I've done I've done a heap of watt bike, um, you know, and going off off that, I, I feel I feel pretty good to be honest. Um, big big issue for, for me, you know, and for all for all big fellas is keeping your weight down, and I've managed to do that. So that's uh, that's the first bit done. Catalans this weekend for the boys. It's important to, to bounce back from that cast defeat. Yeah, definitely. Um, you know, everyone was you know really disappointed with how how we played, and um, you know I think it's. It's just a game which we're trying to put behind us. We, we, we've learned some lessons and we're going to Catalans hopefully coming away with uh, two points.